Hey guys, what's up? Synergy here, and this one is on attrition, guys. And basically, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to town on these kids while they sent me a message. And yeah, we're basically gonna get into the gameplay, guys. So, as you can see here, we're just about to start. As we're coming down, I'm actually gonna use the shock rocks to begin with. Uh, shock rocks perfect for this game type, attrition and stuff like that because they will take down packs of clones and spectres so you can get a nice good start that way. Um, the way I'm going to get my good start is I'm going to basically come across here and as you can see I'm going to do a wee bit of wall gliding madness. Do -do 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 -do. Flying like Superman. I'm actually going to drop down here, I can see that human player but I don't want him to get eyes on me and I'm just going to back around here. <coughs> As if a guy's name is actually Scat. <laughs> As we jump over the wall, this guy's shooting. I'll take that kill, bro. <laughs> Store your kill. Um, we found Flutoon. And we take him out. To my right hand side, and there's a guy actually just looking behind that pipe there. I get sort of confused with this grunt at the minute, as you can see. Got in my way a little bit there, and I just got hit marker, so I want to move, move, move. Want to get out of there, don't want that hit marker to become into a full spray on me. Let's come round there, get eyes on the human player. Miss him on the first try, but get him on the second. Nice and easy. Okay, so what's that? Four kills, is it? As I come out here, unfortunately, Flutoon came back for revenge. He's on 19 attrition point time on 17, so he's actually got a better start than me, believe it or not. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're actually we're not gonna ignore grunts and spectres, we're gonna take those out as well, and you can see in the midst of that I am taking out that human player Seb. Got me Titan through that. Nice and quick, you can see I'm on 24 now. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start taking out all these grunts. As I'm taking it out, I notice that Flutoon's got a Titan up there as well, so I'm just going to inflict some random damage on him. Unfortunately, there's a human player there on the ground, so kind of a bad position for me to be at, but let's see if we can take him out. There we go, so we kill him. Um, what you can see at the minute is basically my shields aren't up, and I'm... Um, what you need to do when your shields aren't up is just simply back away. Don't keep challenging. You might pick up a kill through challenging and stuff like that. But if you back away, you're going to survive a hell of a lot longer, to be honest with you. And you're going to see that exactly well in this sighting as well. Okay. So you can see I actually picked up two human kills through the Titan at the minute. We've got Flutoon here. Now what I want him to do is I want him to challenge me because you see that Titan right behind me now. Come on, where are you, Flutoon? There you go, mistake made, bitch. Okay, increased damage even better. Oh, he's using nuclear injection. Now, we're not going to let him rodeo us because he's going to be pretty damn mad at us, and you can see I took him out of Minerva. The guy behind, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to protect my team, and I'm going to take out the one from the enemy. See, it's a strider, close quarters, and yes, the handler's not good. I do take a bit of damage from him exploding, um, but I quickly regen the shield, and yeah, I might not have much health left, but it'll do. And what you don't want to do is you don't want to say, like, he's either where we just nuclear ejected from his titan. You don't want to basically sprint straight forward because what they can do is they can actually aim and time where they're jumping. So they can just rodeo you yeah, pretty damn easy. I know it because I do it. Okay. See I have the pilot locking symbol on me then at the minute, so I'm in a bit of a pickle at the minute. The shields are down so I need to get out of there and yeah, I knew that was going to happen so... There we go, get out of that, jump on this wall, and rodeo. You might take my time down, bro, but I'm about to take yours down. There we go, one, two, three, four, five. And we jump off, looking around for him, looking around. Where's he gone? There's another Titan, unfortunately, that one does take me out of that. Basically, he came on the hunt for me. Right, so I'm actually using my pull rank card at the minute, so that's 80 seconds of your kill time, your call time, 
uh, not your kill time. God knows what trick I'm talking about there. Yeah, you call time for your Titans and stuff like that, guys. So yeah, I'm gonna get straight back into the Titan because I'm having pretty much a lot of fun with this one at the minute. Doing challenges, as you can see, it's the Bob Rocket. Unfortunately, guys, I've done all these challenges and everything, but I've ended up having to start from scratch basically because of the account. Yeah, simple as. Uh, if I reply to people messaging me, apparently you actually get banned on Xbox Live, so. Yeah, started from scratch, but advantages of this, it allowed me to get the proper uh, name change on, so I've got the proper name now. Um, I'm no longer in Saren, guys, I found this. It was an alright clan, Europeans, I was contemplating with one bars, and it was constantly, a lot of the time, at the top of their team, and everything like that, so they weren't exactly good for me. I am looking for a full clan at the minute. Uh, basically, preferably in the UK or there or thereabouts. Doesn't have to be, I can still play with one bar and all, but obviously the five bar connection is a major advantage for me as well. Okay, so we're going on the road here again, and you can see that that's a nice little tactic to use when you've got Titans, is to watch each other's backs like that. So we'll actually give the team that one, that was very well played. Now you can see, double out grenades, yep, yeah, takes down the Titan shield. Third bot, I'm on the rodeo, and I'm going to take a lot of damage off him straight away. I'm just backing off him at a minute, because I knew that he ejected. I'm actually going to throw two more out grenades, and we're going to get back up there, but he ends up getting taken out. Yeah, the art grenade is really a beast against titans, so your flunk, you go to art grenades, you've basically got the shield style. If the titan's nearby, chances are he's going to win that gunfire, as long as they don't do the same. <laughs> and yet again, happy to rodeo again. How many titans can these guys seriously have up at the minute? I was like that thinking, ah, oh, what am I going to be stopping with all the old titans? So there we go, we draw the old that one, I bring in my titan and I crush his titan! That flow x is going to be pretty mad about that because he had a titan on four health as well, but yeah. Call me titan in, hoping it would land right on him, and it did. So simple as that. Okay, so score at the minute is 252. 228, blah blah blah. Um, yeah, I know I said that a bit wrong, but the score was sort of taken well as commentating as well. Um, so, yeah, you can actually see it is a close game, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to start working on these drugs, working on these spectres, getting that score to go up nice and fast so we can sort of build the gap, build the bridge between, and not give them a chance to win this at all. And a bit of spray there, but at least I got that human player to back off. Even though I didn't get a kill for that one. Lots of uh, groups, lots of spectres, and uh, you can see the amount of attrition points they're doing there in the middle of the screen where my actual gun is. And we get the damage bar on there. 288, two points to go. You can see the scoreboard at the minute. There you go, help my team out. Boom, 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 boom. Pilot lock in, pilot lock in. If you get a pilot lock in, don't be afraid of using your shields because you can catch the rocket, see where they are, and then you can hunt them down. As you can see, I can actually see them there, so I'm just trying to get them to the back off that section. Now what the team's obviously going to do at the minute is they're going to try and take down the chopper. It's a 92 point attrition gameplay. You can see the score at the end of the game as well. Um, you did see me flickering through it a little bit there, but yeah, it'll stay more solid at the end. Here we go, drop shit. Boom, boom, boom. Oh no, I need to reload better until we use my rocket salvo there. I'm taking out as much damage, hopefully these titans are in there as well, and unfortunately it's going to get away! No! Okay, so on that time, the, it actually did get away, but there was nobody in it for it to be So 
Well, for 31 million kills, 3 deaths gives you 92 points. So that's quite good there, guys. You can see Flutane has already rage quit. 